Hi, I'm Amy Siever. I am the creator of Armigos. Um, Armigos are little stuffed animals. They are plush toys that are a mix between, the, the word Armigo is a mix between arm and amigo, and it's a friend that you can wear on your arm. They are made for kids. Uh, this is Zach the Zebrat. He is half zebra, half cat. He is a hybrid. They are all hybrids at this point. In the future, there will be other lines that aren't hybrids, but for now, uh, the next quite uh, the next few I develop are going to be hybrids. And this one here is um, Flash. He is uh, part leopard and part koala. His story came about where he was um, a wild pack of hyenas was chasing him, and he when he just a leopard. And a wild pack of hyenas was chasing him, and he is running, 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 and then he jumps into a tree for safety, and he collides into a koala. And now he is a koala. So um, he is one, and then I also have the lizard here. The lizard, lizard is a half lizard, half shark with about the cutest smile you'll ever see. Um, there will eventually be collector's of editions of this one, although I will not disclose what makes them collector's editions yet. Um, they all have interesting stories. They all are very friendly, familiar, and um, kind of like survivor stories, how they, how they adapted and, and turned into what they are now that makes them so lovable. Okay, so the way we came up with Armigos is um, I have uh, my, my kids, I'm a single mom with three kids. Um, they all have a desperate love of stuffed animals. And to tell you the truth, when I started this, I really didn't like stuffed animals. They would drive me crazy. Um, first of all, my kids are very active. So um, the animals would tend to fly around the house. They would um, kind of get their, those hard eyes would get crushed up onto things. And it, I'd hear clank, clank, clank. It would drive me nuts. We'd leave them at stores. They'd expect me to go back and find them. And always, you know, with work and school and all the things we have to take care of, we just really didn't have the time to squeeze in time for these stuffed animals. But my kids literally love stuffed animals. And so what Armigos does is it takes the problem of not, you know, of looking for your stuffed animal. You don't have to find it anymore. Now it's attached to the arm. The kids can actually still go to the playground, they can climb the monkey bars, they can still ride their bikes, they can do whatever they need to do to stay active with the stuffed animal on their arm and set it in their hands. Um, they help for like when kids are afraid to walk down the dark hallway um, or to go brush their teeth alone. So when I first had the Armigos idea, I went actually um, and was talking to um, to do my market research. So I talked to a lot of kids, I talked to my own kids, I talked to kids in the neighborhood. Um, I talked to friends and um, we came up with some really great ideas. I had some kids in the neighborhood actually build me a prototype. His dad helped him, but they built me a prototype for one of the games we have that's gonna be out in a few years. Um, the really cool thing about this is it's a very kid design product. Um, I have definitely got a designer and myself on the task of, of designing something that really, really will work. But I have, it's, it's all very kid inspired, so it works really well for kids. So far, um, they seem really interested in the product. They're really enjoying creating it and they're enjoying being a part of the whole thing. Okay, so the call to action. I have 3,000 Armigos being delivered on August, or being shipped over on August 30th of 2022. Um, then I will be on the market. I would like to continue my manufacturing. I've already seen so much interest in these. I know they'll sell pretty quickly. And with Christmas coming, I would really like to keep my manufacturing going and not slow down. Um, um, I also have a game board coming out and to be able to provide the game board that really is what really brings these army goes to life. Um, and really is what's gonna provide the a lot of the needs for most of the kids and moms um, is to be able to continue that game board design and to have that manufactured very soon as well. So to keep all those things going, I'm um, hoping I can get people to contribute and uh, really help build this product with me. Thank, Thank you for helping us bring our vision to life. life.